Do you have a Creality style printer and a Mac computer? Are you struggling to get the correct format on your SD cards? Then you're going to want to watch this video. To upgrade the firmware on your 3D printer, you're going to need a properly formatted SD card. For those of you with Macs, unfortunately it's not just as simple as heading into the disk utility and formatting the card, and I'm going to show you why. Here I am, moving into my SD card. By clicking Erase, uh, I decide how I'm going to format it. I'm going to rename the SD card Creality. I'm going to select from the drop down menu MS DOS FAT. This is what I've looked at on the internet. It tells me that I need to use this format, but unfortunately, doing it this way just won't work. The reason for that is the number of bytes per cluster 32,768. We only need 4,096. Thankfully, we can do that on a Mac. The first thing you want to do is head over back into your launch pad and find the terminal. Once you're in the terminal, in the command line, you're going to want to write disk util list. Now be very careful of uppercase and lowercase and spaces. Once you've hit return, you're going to be looking for your identifier. It may be different to mine, so I'm going to write my identifier in red. The next thing you're going to write is disk util info, then your identifier, a vertical line, grep device with a capital D. Again, be careful on these uppercases and lowercases. Now look for your device node. Again, it may be different to mine, so just be aware of that. And the next thing you're going to type is disk util, unmount disk, or one word with a capital D for disk, force, and then again, your device node. That'll unmount all of the volumes on that disk. So it's blank, it's ready to be reformatted how you want it. So here we go again, careful with uppercase and lowercase, sudo new fs underscore ms dos negative uppercase f for the fat type, which is going to be 32, negative lowercase v, you can name this whatever you want, I'm going to call it printer, negative lowercase b for your bytes, 4096, and then your device node again. Hit enter, you're going to be asked for your password, type that in. And then it'll do a little bit of work. And as your command line pops up, that'll be the job done. As I pop my SD card back in, you're going to see that it's renamed to printer, which is what I put after the negative V. And there it is, ready for you to upload your new firmware on, and that'll work with your printer. Thanks for watching.